In the wake of the rising cases of cervical cancer in Zimbabwe, the Chinese government has donated medical equipment and drugs to help prevent and treat cervical cancer. Mbuya Nehanda Maternity Hospital in Harare received the donations, as well as six Chinese doctors who will work in the hospital for the next two weeks, assisting patients and training local doctors. It is estimated that over 1,800 women in Zimbabwe are diagnosed with cervical cancer and about 1,500 die of the disease every year. This situation of trying to provide services for prevention and control has been made better, especially today for perennial group of hospitals, thanks to the Chinese team from Hunan Provincial Martin and Child Health Care Hospital. We have come to give us support as we are going to hold a 10-day camp for the same cause. Zimbabwe and China have maintained strong ties that date back to the liberation struggle. China has supported Zimbabwe in the health department since independence through building hospitals, providing equipment and medical drugs. The Chinese government is dedicated in bilateral health care and the medical exchanges since 1985. We have already sent 14 batches of medical teams with a total sum of 100 and 30 specialists to Zimbabwe. The Chinese doctors have worked closely with the local hospitals and provided many philanthropic medical checks and consultations all over Zimbabwe. Many cancer patients have no access to screening, early diagnosis, treatment or even palliative care including pain relief. Most patients seek health care at an advanced stage of the disease when treatment prospects are greatly diminished. We are very happy with this program because we had become hopeless with our condition. We are very thankful to the Chinese who have brought these machines. This will go a long way in assisting more women. Cervical cancer is the most common cancer among women, accounting for 33.4% of all cancer cases among women. A medical team coming from China will follow up on the hospital's progress, as well as renew cooperation in maternal and child health care between the two countries. Leslie Marungu, CCTV.